My name is Mike Fishball. I'm network manager of a 900 student um, college. Myself and two other part-time staff. Responsibility is to maintain the school network, make sure it's smooth running, um, do the AV uh, and make sure the school runs smoothly. Okay, the idea behind the, the, the changes we envisaged was to give ourselves more control over the overall network, to allow a lot more flexibility for users and students, um, and, and to actually take more interest and more responsibility for our own establishment. Most of our IT um, requirements um, were supplied by ACS, and it became quickly became aware of the fact that their knowledge or the ACS staff knowledge of, of products was, was really very good um, and it led on to the fact that the knowledge for the technical side of it was also as good so when we bid for the migration several companies uh, um, bid for it um, ACS were head and shoulders above the rest as far as their technical knowledge was concerned. Okay. The position we were in when we decided to make the change was um, our hardware was insufficient, it was, uh, it was old and clunky, um, and we had been given the opportunity to purchase um, a series of servers um, from a, a, a company that was, uh, was uh, closing down and selling up. And one of the nice things about ACS is they were the only company that were actually going to help us integrate this what was essentially second-hand equipment. Um, they listened to what we wanted and they were they created their plan to actually uh, utilize the second-hand stuff. So when Chris came in um, the original setup, the hardware setup, the um, machine upgrades that were needed etc and so forth I was quite happy to do with Chris holding my hand. Okay, well originally ACS um, did all the planning um, and all the migration uh, procedures that they were going to do and gave, kept us up to date with what was going on. Initially, the first three days, uh, their engineer came in and assisted me um, in putting the hardware together, any upgrades or changes we needed to make to the hardware to suit the way we wanted the migration to go ahead. While that was going on, it became apparent that seven years out of the loop of uh, the Windows basic networks, uh, my knowledge was slightly down on what it should have been. So from, the, the, from that point on, four days of remote access from ACS um, to actually complete the installation um, and get the network actually running. This was all done over a period of about three weeks. The targets we actually gave ACS were incredibly tight. They did a brilliant job in actually putting it together in the time we gave them. One thing that actually came out of the migration process um, while ACS were actually installing the software was the need for me to take on extra training to be able to maintain the network at the end of the, at the, end of the day. ACS set up a, a training um, program for me um, to, I, to highlight just the knowledge that I needed to go. It was only a top up really um, and again the training was really well targeted to actually give me what I needed to maintain the network. What we've been able to do with ACS's help is to actually achieve the network we required within a, sustain, a sustainable budget. Yeah, one of the biggest things that I've seen and, uh, and have taken control of, over is the flexibility we have to give students more or less um, access to IT throughout the, the, their time within the college. Staff um, are given basically free reign of, over the use of the PCs. So the flexibility of, of giving the kids what they need as they progress through their IT um, year has, has improved enormously. Another reason for um, the migration was we knew in the very near future there was going to be a rather large increase in IT use across the college. Currently we are having a new sixth form college um, extension built to um, the school which will increase our IT usage by some 400 PCs. 
our original network structure would not have covered that. So the next part of the project, which I hope ACS will be involved in, is to actually re fiber cable the entire school to take account of the, of the heavier and, and new usage. Okay, one of the first things um, that I noticed about the project was when we made the initial approach, ACS were the only company that didn't try and sell us something that we didn't actually need. We gave those, we gave them the, uh, the structure of what we, we wanted, they came back with a solution to fit our, our requests. The project itself ran very smoothly, the planning was done, we knew exactly what was going to happen, they did exactly what they said they were going to do, and at the end of the day the project went through trouble free. We had no further call um, to put right any glitches that they hadn't done in the first place. The whole project was very well managed.